Make in front of it. What'd you Look do? The mess of it. I know I ran over a grease can or something. Yeah, now you're gonna say, Dad, how do I get that off? It's called the pressure washer, bud. No, sandpaper. Sandpaper? Sand yeah, I got grease in my car. I just sand it off. That's a great idea. No, I'll give you Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's happening, oh my god, oh my god. Dad, it's happening, oh my god. It's here, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, it's here, oh my god. They got important business shit going on, but I don't. Oh my god. Let's go open this. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to my channel. Today we're going to do something that I've actually never done before. We're doing an unboxing. Actually, we're going to do two unboxings. So, I've actually been looking at what's inside this box for about, I don't know, two, two and a half years now. So, I'm so excited to get into this. I've looked at them online. I've never actually held it in my hands. So, today's going to be the first time I actually get to hold one of these suckers. Let's get into it. You guys want to know how bad I am at doing unboxings? I opened these with a spoon. Forgot to hit record. Here, let's see what's in these boxes. Oh, let's open that one next. The camera that I'm using now is a Nikon D750 with an 18 to 200 millimeter lens. So here we have a Sony Alpha 18 to 135 lens. So very similar to what I'm used to using, but I think I've outgrown my lens now. It's got a little quirks. I'll show you guys in this video what I mean. But I think it was time for me to upgrade my equipment. Got a mic, got a lens. So naturally, you can assume what's in this box here. So this is a camera, camera body I've been looking at for two and a half years. And I finally pulled the trigger. The Sony Alpha A7R4. Let's see what's inside. 61 megapixels. 10 frames per second. Real time autofocus eye tracking. All this, okay. I already know about all this and I assume you don't care. So let's see what this thing looks like. Oh. <laughs> it's like Christmas. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so we got charger, charging cable. We got that fine quality leather strap there. And here she is. Alright guys, thanks for tuning into my video. That'll be it. Just kidding. Oh my god. This is it. My dream camera. It's even more beautiful than I imagined. Alright, now let's get into this lens. Oh my god, this is so exciting. So I already noticed a huge difference when it comes to weight for this camera versus my camera that I'm filming on with now. The lens is, wow, a lot smaller, a lot more compact and weighs a lot less. It's so, so new though, I don't even want to like touch it. I should have ordered a screen protector for this thing. It's even got a hot shoe cap, like, oh my god. Sony, I love you. Oh, just like any other camera, you find that white dot, you line it up, and you send it home. Oh my god, this thing is beautiful. What do you guys think? Alright guys, so there it is. I'm sure you don't want to see me sitting here and talking about all the specs. If you know the camera, you know the camera. Um, I actually want to show you guys the reason why I got this camera. I'm going to take down my camera that I'm filming with now. I'm going to show you the differences. So we're actually going to film with this right now, see how it goes. So I'm going to get this charged up, then put it on the tripod, and then I'm going to show you the camera that I'm used to and give you some points on why I thought I was ready for an upgrade. So give me a minute, going to charge you up, and we'll see you in five. All right guys, here we are. So we are now being filmed, well, I am now being filmed on the Sony Alpha 7R4. I haven't changed any settings on the Sony. I literally just hit record, threw this mic on, this video blog mini mic or whatever. So hopefully this mic's good. Hopefully the settings are good on this. But so as you guys can see, like this is a big camera. It's very heavy. Um, it does the job for sure. Like it's great for photos, great for video. But there's a couple issues that I've been having with it. But you'll notice it kind of drops down. 
So that's kind of an issue when I want to do stuff like these unboxing videos because I do want to try to film from above from like certain things. So that's been an issue that I've had is I kind of go to lean down for a shot and then the lens zooms in on me. The camera's turned on and you go to zoom in and you're recording, you can actually hear clicks coming from the lens. So if you're filming something other than B-roll, it kind of ruins the shot. Um, you don't really want to hear clicks over people talking and stuff. So that's the reason why I would either get a new lens for this camera or just spend the money and get the Sony. The Sony is so compact. It's so much lighter than this. It's actually probably about half the weight. Yeah, so I'm super happy with the Sony. It does 120 frames per second, which is something that I've been looking forward to playing around with. I love shooting in slow motion. I love being able to speed videos up. Um, but yeah, 4K capability. I really think it was time for me to buy a better camera when it comes to filming because I really want to step up my YouTube channel. I really want to get more involved in filming for my community, getting hired for film gigs. So I think it's time. And my first impressions on this camera right out of this box is I'm so happy I bought this camera. So I just want to thank you guys for sticking around and watching this video. If you like this video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe. I appreciate any support I can get from you guys. Share the video if you really like it. Um, stick around. The next couple videos I'm going to do is we're going to take this Sony outside and we're going to test some 120 FPS. We're going to test some shutter speeds. We're going to test basically all around the camera and we'll film it along the way. So if you guys want to see some comparison videos or if you just want to see how this camera can perform, stick around and we'll find out together. Take care guys. Stay safe.